it's Petunia Gal, and we are back in a Planet Zoo on the Yamaguchi Prefecture Tranquility Zoo. And I've done uh, quite a bit. I got a little carried away with off-camera work. Um, so I got all the animals in, um, and I think set up, like, education for all of them. But we've got the lions in here. We've got donation boxes and education boards and all that. And, um, in these, I did have to change out the, um, Western chimpanzee, I think is what it's called, right? Let's see. Um, and I don't know why it says they're hungry when there's food right there. It always happens, and I, I don't know why. But, um, they needed more climbing space than the lemurs, so I went ahead and put them in here because there's a couple of different... Uh, climbing areas for them and uh, if we go over here I put the red rough lemurs in this one um, one of these do need a little or does I don't know one of these needs a little bit more climbing space can I please click on there you go all right so obviously it's not this one this one's good um, and yeah I've been doing a lot of research to try to get things open and um, able to get uh, their enrichments in. So as you can see, we've got a lot of people. We've got a lot of people. Um, and you guys probably were yelling at me when I tried to put the tortoise and the Chinese pangolin in. Um, yeah, they do not work together. So they need different things. So we went ahead, I went ahead and put the Chinese pangolin in here. What I want to do this episode if we look at our um, objectives, as you can see, I've gotten these uh, pretty much done. We need to finish the transport ride. And also, um, I have, I don't know why it's showing that it's done. Oh, this animal died of old age. Oh, that's too bad. All right. Because um, we still need to put the giant tortoise in. So, I'm not quite sure why. I guess because I technically already placed it, but I took it back out because it was with the Chinese penguin. So, um, I want to find a space that we can build. I don't want to put it in here because this is a way bigger habitat than, than they need. Uh, but what I think I'm going to do, I don't even know if they need water. Uh, I don't think they do. So, what I think I'm going to do for now... I was going to just add one over here, but I think I'm going to split this. Do is we'll add so like that um, right here. I think that works. No, don't do that. Okay. Cooperate. This may be too small. We'll see. So I was thinking of just adding it here. And then we'll also add habitat gate over here maybe is this still no I was going to say is this still considered part of that habitat but I guess is it like too close oh no it's there we go we just had to move closer alright we'll put this right there alright awesome so this will be for the tortoise and actually Let's go ahead and just, oh, okay, so I, I kind of heard that. That's crazy. So I've got the vets on a lot of these. Um, you'd think some of these would be done by now. I mean, I, I don't know. And I went ahead and uh, trained a lot of the people to be a little bit higher level so they can get things done faster and all kinds of stuff like that. Go ahead and go to animals. I want to bring in the Galapagos giant tortoise and move that. And I'll show you what else I've been doing to kind of make some money. Let's go ahead. I'm going to not have it fast forward. And I'm going to go here. Uh, as you can see, we've got a lot of these um, exhibit animals. So these guys aren't happy probably because of the space. Um, what I'm probably going to do is actually sell the older ones. I I don't know if inbreeding is a thing. Um, 
with the exhibit animals. I mean, obviously it should be, but I don't think it is. So let's go ahead and get those. We can just do those for now if we want to. Nile monitor. Oh, Nile monitor had babies. Awesome. Um, we'll go ahead. Nope, not that one. <laughs> that one's probably gonna die of old age. Oh, that's sad. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Nope, that. I'll do these for now. So we'll send these to the trade center. That, and then if we go to exhibit trading and go down to storage. We can just do select all and do quick, quick trade. And that way we can get money. Yay! So I'm really glad I started those um, exhibits because, yeah, that will definitely help us out. So let's get this giant tortoise in and see what he wants. Obviously, he can't, like, jump this, so we're good. Oh, that research is complete. Yay! We need all the vet research we can get. And I am playing this on medium mode, uh, medium difficulty. So it's not going to make it where the animals get tired of their enrichments. Either that or they don't get tired as fast. I don't, I don't know for sure, but it'll be fine. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to paint most of this away. So he, they don't really like long grass. And why does it show that much long grass? That's crazy. I'll do H. Um, let's select the tortoise. Okay, so yeah, they can get all over there. Awesome. Um, is there any enrichments that we can give? Nope. Um, let's go to Galapagos. There it is. Okay. Yeah, let's see. They don't like that. All right. I didn't think so. That seemed kind of weird. I was like, I don't think I've ever seen a turtle use a scratching uh, thing. But whatever. Okay, well, let's do this. And the thing is, there's not going to be any flat area to put these that I know of. But we'll, we'll put it right here. Let's see. There we go. And let's go ahead and go over to enrichment. So let's do a sprinkler. Do a sprinkler right there. Oh, 91%. Awesome. Okay. So we got that. Let's go ahead. And we should really put some lights down here. But for now, we'll just uh, make sure we got some donation boxes. It's going to be inside the habitat a little bit. I'm not too worried about that. Um... I just, I don't like it on the sidewalk, uh, on the path, because I know there's not an animal in here, but I'm going to put donation boxes anyways. I don't like it on the path, because then people have to walk around it, and it's, it's just weird. I don't like it. And they're going to throw the money in there anyways. What we could also do, if we wanted to, is um, we could... Let's go to architecture and walls. We could do columns. Um, I thought there was like a brick column. But we, what we could do is, if we wanted to, is hide this. I don't think... It doesn't seem like all the columns. Uh, I don't know. That's weird. But that's what we could do if we wanted to. Um, obviously, I'm not going to worry about it right now. But it, it's a... It's a thing. It's a thing we could do. So let's go ahead and get this. And I think I'll just get the regular board because we can just do a V for a line to surface and put one here. Oh my gosh, that tree is so in the way. Um, let's put one over there. Okay. So we'll do... Galapagos and Galapagos and then we'll also put a speaker because I want to keep uh, I want to do education education oh what hold on pause <laughs> uh, I think our uh, lion grew up uh, I don't I don't want to do it that way 
And the next thing we need to do is build the transport ride. So we can get into that too. Let's do, uh, oh, all right. Got more of those. Let's go to animals. Get rid of that. Okay. Uh, yeah, we got so many animals now. It's crazy. Okay. So I think, um, oh, we've got two. Okay. Yeah, definitely need to... We'll just release those. That'll also help with our conservation rating. Which is good. And those were pretty high values too, so that's cool. Alright, so let's do this. Um, let's go ahead and get this ride finished. Um, although, I don't know if it's going to help or hurt our money situation. But we'll see. So I'm just going to click, uh, I'm just going to double click on the track, uh, or click on it, whatever. Edit track. Okay. So, uh, I could just auto complete this, um, but I may, cause I know it's going to be a little weird in some places. Stop moving. <laughs> it's going to be a little weird in some places. I'm going to go ahead and try to curve it kind of around the path here. Okay, is there a, a camera? What do we want? Let's do free. Because I don't like it. It keeps moving. I don't like it. Okay, so we'll go ahead and move this over a little bit. Because obviously we don't want it like running into buildings, right? So it'll come right over the entrance here. And at some point we can do autocomplete if we want to. And I may go ahead and just, nope, not that. This, make it go longer. I keep, I keep hitting the buttons when I don't mean to. Okay, where is the other part of the track? Okay, let's have it turn this way. Okay, if we do autocomplete, what does it give us? Oh, that doesn't look bad. Although, I think this could be up a little higher, but I think that's good. We'll autocomplete that. Okay. And then where's the next part that is incomplete? Uh, we got it going in there, over here. I think this is where it stops. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. We'll click. Uh, actually, let's go up. Uh, can we go up a little bit? Let's go up a little bit. Because it's going to go over these. I don't... Where is it going? We go back down. Oh, it's going over there. I see where it's going. Let's bring it over like that. Bring it. I don't want to bring it like super far down, but we click on that. Awesome. And then this over here is a very short area, so we can do this. Uh, click on that. Click, click. Come on, click on it. There we go. So I'll bring it down a little bit and connect. Okay, now what else? So let's go ahead and stop test. Oh, there we go. <laughs> wow. <laughs> You've really done us proud by passing that inspection. The World Association of Zoos, Zoological Organizations, and Complementary or Kindred Societies. <sighs> Could not be more impressed with your efforts in getting all those animals rehomed so quickly. You know, they actually told me they were considering giving us an award. But hey, I told them not to bother because the work itself was reward enough. Oh, and also, it would have been made out of single-use plastic. Oh, anyone believe what I just heard? That dead I told you about earlier? 
just the tip of the iceberg. The accountants have discovered even more holes in the books, and we've got to fill them. Good news, though. Our final batch of animals has been returned to the zoo. Oh, and make sure they're happy for when the reporter arrives. <gasps> oh, my. I've just received the most amazing news. Lin Lin the panda is going to be loaned to us. <laughs> now, the investigators have completely exonerated you. Apparently, they always suspected Mr. Myers was up to something. Anyway, I know this is very last minute, but I don't suppose you could build a suitable habitat for Lin Lin, could you? Okay, so we have to build a habitat for Lin Lin, but I think, let's, let's do this first. Because last time when I put all the animals in, it's a very bad idea. I should not have done that. Definitely not. Let's go ahead and we'll take the Japanese macaques because I know exactly where we're going to put those. Send a zoo. And I think, because I haven't been doing this and I've uh, been lucky so far, but I want to put these guys into quarantine. And I guess we could put all of them into quarantine. Well, no, we can't because th that's going to be too many. But we'll, we'll put those guys in quarantine. This might be too many too, but... Why does this have a... Oh, okay. So, I guess some of them we just got more of the same animals that we already have. The problem with the western chimpanzee, I think that's what we just... Yeah. Is um, they, they already don't like the habitat. It's too uh, crowded. So, that might be, might be a little bit of an issue. So, let's go ahead... And hit play. And let's see. Where are we going to put a habitat for Lin Lin? I wonder if we could put one like right here. I'm going to look at um, Zoopedia. And let's do... I was about to type in Lin Lin. That's not going to help. Giant panda. Let's see. 9688, zero water. Okay. All right. So that's not going to work. I mean, we could always take out the water, but I would like to find an area that we don't have to uh, worry about that. I'm thinking we'll put it right here, actually. Because this is a fairly big area. And I think that'll work. Unless quarantine full stat. Yeah, see, I knew that was going to happen. That's why I didn't do anything earlier. I want to see if we can just make this. Nope, don't do that. Add. Oh my goodness. So since Lin Lin is just one animal, let's go ahead and see if we can put her in. I think it's her, right? Oh, there we go. Yep, it's her. I figured Lin Lin was a she. I've worked with her before, but, you know, it's fine. Uh, I'm sure we're going to have to make this uh, habitat barrier uh, taller. But for now, we'll just wait till we get her in. Let's see, what do we got? Uh, past, past. I wonder if the western chimpanzee... I wonder if I had that in from before. That might have been an issue. Um, and let's see, we have the for, for, Formosan black bear. I always get uh, a little, a little weird on that uh, pronunciation. What did I do? Oh, I wanted to see the, uh, Zoopedia. <laughs> but it's okay. Okay, so I'm wondering if the space is just because of the trees. Um, let's get rid of what uh, what they what she doesn't like and see if that helps with the space issue. Uh, that 
Go ahead and play. So it helped a little bit, but we can't, we can't extend this out at all. So I'm wondering if we just get rid of these. So we don't have to have the rocks. It just kind of, kind of adds a little bit more life to, to the exhibit, uh, to the habitat, but we'll see how this goes. And I think what I'll do is let's go ahead hit I to get rid of that. I'll just move some of these a little bit so they're not like super close together. All right, let's do H, habitat. We'll go ahead and play. See how that works. Well, that seemed like it gave her more room, but still not the best. I think it'll have to do for now. Let's get rid of these other rocks. Uh, oh, peafowl. Yeah, I really need to do that. I'll, I'll do, like, sending animals uh, to the wild and stuff in between. Because I don't, I don't think you guys need to see me do that, right? So let's do soil. Put soil around. And let's go ahead. Oh, this is... This is super high intensity soil. That's not what we want. And then we'll do the low intensity around. And I'll put it back here towards the door, the gate. Because, you know, when when keepers come in and the animal's walking around, it's going to get a little trodden uh, everywhere. So I think they'll be fine. We'll add low, low intensity grass around. And there we go. Okay. I need to make sure, though. I didn't check. This says it's escapable. Why is that? Oh, wait. Is this... Um, let's pause for a second. Is this climbable? I don't think it is. It is climbable. Okay. I doubt they would be, I don't know. It's only on this one side. So what if we go ahead and just take that and that and bring it up just like that. Is that going to be okay or do we still need to add? Because we can add the anti-climb things. Why can't I escape? Let me get out. Not letting me get out of the thing. There we go. Let's go ahead and do H and let's play for a second. Recalculate. All right. That's so weird. Is one of these climbable? Like, is one of the trees climbable or something? Oh well. We'll just go ahead and add the anti climb things, and that should be good. Should be. I don't know. Let's go ahead and do that. Some of these... Oh, not all the way around. Come on, stop it. Okay, we'll do that again. Let's do it from over here. There we go. Okay. Because I don't need all that. Come on. Cooperate. Let's do that. Alright, and then we'll do... Settings, climb proof. I never can figure out which side this is. I think this is on the outside. Pretty sure. Yeah. So we'll do the other side. There we go. Okay, that should help. Let's go ahead. I still can't exit. What the heck? That is so weird. Exit isn't, uh, like, escape is not working for me. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that and hit play. So yeah, everything looks good now. No more escape escape routes. Awesome. Okay. So I think that is probably where we're going to end. This may be a little bit of a longer episode. We'll see how much I can cut out. 
But yeah, the escape button is not working. It's driving me crazy. Um, so let me know what you guys think. Uh, should I have put these somewhere else? Um, should I have put the panda somewhere else or made? I, I don't know. It's hard to know what like habitats to make. But yeah, we'll get back into this next time. I hope you guys had it. Uh, enjoyed. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. And, um, yeah, some of this goes really far down. I don't know. Um, if you have any questions, comments, tips, anything like that, definitely leave those down below in the comment section. Like I said, let me know what you guys think about what, what we've done, how you would do it. Um, you know, how you guys have kept money coming in because obviously I had issues with that. Um, so until next time, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy and, um, yeah, I will see you next time. Have a blessed day and yeah. Bye guys.